Good morning, Lakers. Did you know that the month of March is Women's History Month? Let's find out how much Lakers know about Women's History Month. Who was the first woman to run for U.S. president? <laughs> Hillary Clinton. Victoria Woodhull. What percent of Congress is made up of women? Two percent. Five percent. Twenty-seven percent. In what year were women allowed to legally vote? 1920. 1965. Who was the first woman in space? Amelia Earhart. Sally Ride. What is the theme of this year's Women's History Month? Um, feminist pride. The theme is celebrating women who tell our stories. What percent of active duty military members are women? Uh, 10%? Um, I'm going to say 15. 14%. Good job. Who was the first female governor of a U.S. state? I have no clue. Wyoming Governor Nellie Taylor Rose. Mm -hmm. When did Women's History Month begin? Nineteen eighty-two. Nineteen eighty-seven. You were close. Mm -hmm. Why is Women's History Month important to celebrate within West Bloomfield High School? Oh, I think we have a lot to celebrate here. The West Bloomfield girls just won the district championship again for the second time in a row. Uh, they won the state championship last year. I think that we have a lot of things going on that uh, certainly supports all the girls in this school. Well, I think it's always important to, you know, show women in a positive light, to be good role models. See, you know, they've had a lot of struggles throughout the years, obviously, as you know, um, and just to get equality. So I think it's always great to kind of highlight that. Well, there's a variety of reasons, but I think in my role as the college and career counselor, it's important to acknowledge the women that have gone before us to push the uh, boundaries so women could have a right to an education and to take advantage in the variety of STEM fields that were predominantly male-dominated that we now have the opportunity to pursue whatever dreams we want.